All right, which or pair? Excuse me, is in the solution set. Well, we can graph both, or we can plug these points in to find out. It's really up to you on um, what you want to do, but I think I'll use a calculator. It's just so much faster. Um, so first, we have a less than and then a greater than or equal to, which is pretty standard, and I have these set already to it. So to, to set them to less than or greater than or whatever, <coughs> excuse me, you scroll to the left for whatever function you're on, all the way to the left. And hit enter until you get a region above or below. You see this little triangle pop up above a line. That means greater than. And then if it's lower than, the lower triangle, it means less than. So fortunately, that's what we have here. We have 2x plus 2, right? And y is less than it, so it's the region below the, the line. And the next one, here we have negative x, negative x, minus 1. Okay, then the graphing calculator will graph both for us. Oops, apologize. Oh, I didn't type it correctly. So it's negative x, clear it off. Sorry, negative x minus 1. Okay, now if we graph both, what's going to happen is the graphing calculator will show you the shaded region. And you can kind of see here that 2, 0 is the point that's actually in both. And if you're not entirely convinced, plug 2 as the x value and plug 0 as the y value into each inequality, and you'll see it's the only point that really works for both.